Hello and welcome to another special video review and today we've got the MS-30 Amy from Mechanic Studios and apparently it's also a collaboration with Dr. Wu. <laughs> so yeah, we've got here a um, legend size RC uh, from Dr. Wu and collaboration with uh, Mechafence Toys and she's actually pretty damn cool for, for a small one. So yeah, we've got the box, cool heart, legal stuff, a couple of little screenshots and yeah, that's pretty much it. Let's, let's stop wasting time with the box. <laughs> so there we go. We got a box in the background. We got all the stuff here. We've got a cool plastic card. Kind of like a credit card size, but uh, smooth and grainy. Got the bio right here. If you're interested, pause it and read it because I won't. <laughs> I'm not really big into cards. And we have the really huge instructions. And. Uh, it's just so weird. I mean, the the, the drawings are not that big, but that, that sheet is just humongous. And there's like 27 steps is uh, okay, I guess. But uh, yeah, the, the drawings are kind of dark, so it's kind of hard to see what moves. So, yeah, but the transformation is very easy, so there's no really big problem with this. So, we've got... Yeah, the figure and its accessories right here. So, oink. So, first of all, we got a replacement face. Now, I didn't know which face it went onto, like which figures. Apparently, from someone in the forum, uh, it come, it goes on the masterpiece face uh, replacement. So, I'll try this later, because I'm real curious. <laughs> but always, we have weapons. So, we have a sort of machine gun rifle. Pretty cute, not much to it, just paint plastic, and doesn't pay really anywhere on car mode, so that's disappointing. But we also have our pistol, and the pistol does peg into the vehicle mode, has a, some, some storage. So, yeah, and finally we have the vehicle mode, and yeah, it's pretty damn cute, I love the vehicle mode. Looks great, uh, we do have like uh, the... Uh, sort of spoiler tail fin vent thing in the back that moves like this so you just straighten them up like this because in robot mode it needs to be back down so yeah pretty damn cool uh, it does roll but <laughs> yeah and we have the peg in the middle right here that you can peg in the weapon but it's really small I'm trying to do it yeah my big clumsy fingers ah. <laughs> Come on. Yeah. There you go. Or maybe it goes on the other side, but eh, it goes. There you go. But again, we don't have any storage for the uh, bigger rifle, so that's disappointing. Would have been nice somewhere aside. I don't know. But yeah, really cool figure. Uh, well, vehicle mode. Nice blue tinted window. Well, metallic window. It's not tinted. Uh, we do have the back, uh, the, the front plate, it's colored gray, no hotel lights or anything, but uh, yeah, kind of cool. I'm not a big fan of those gaps on the side, but yeah, for the size of the figure, I mean, <laughs> it's just still amazing, you know? So, yeah, we can do a quick comparison with other RC, but uh, yeah, she has a legend size, pretty cool. So, here's a comparison with all my RCs right now in the... Uh, in uh, vehicle mode, uh, I'm missing two to be honest. <laughs> I'm missing like the uh, eye gear one. I have it, but I can't transform it anymore because she broke, and you know, uh, I can't transform it anymore. But uh, yeah, and I'm also missing the Bumblebee uh, Studio Series RC, which is in the mail, so I should have her real soon, hopefully. <laughs> but yeah, we got the uh, Mech Fan Toys here with Dr. Wu uh, figure. We got the Unique Toys, I know, DX9, uh, Two Iron Factory, the Valkyrie, uh, I think this is the Mini Toy World, uh, Shoto Q, Generation, no, no, the Earthrise, Eye Gear, Animated, Generation. Uh, the uh, other animated, uh, I don't remember one, the late one, uh, the latest one, uh, Titans Return, uh, uh, the uh, la, 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 Cybertronian uh, Di the Rid, I think, uh, Prime Hunter, Oculus Max, Toy World, uh, this is the, 
fan stories. <laughs> I've got so much. Masterpiece. Now you see uh, Prime Animated. Uh, just Prime. Uh, the, uh, the Legacy one. So... Yeah, uh, this was a doozy to transform them all and gather them. <laughs> I hope you appreciate. So, yeah, let's continue. All right, now for the transformation. I guess it's very, uh, very interesting and very easy transformation. So first up, you're going to take the back of the cars uh, like this and open them up like this. Flip those tiny tab here above like this. Come to the underneath, and then you're gonna unpeg the legs. The feet are uh, pegged on the front of the car, so unpeg them and flip the whole waist like this. And you can just close the leg in, take the feet, rotate the toes, and flatten the feet. So go like this, and now we have the leg all done. Next up, you want to take the arm, flip them open like this, and bring them down. Flip them open, bring them down, and just make sure that they are sort of like perfectly straight. Like you can't open them up like way further, but they need to be like this, facing straight. Next up, you want to take the front of the vehicle, push it down, and unfold it. And then you need to sort of like bend the head and pass it through. Like this, and bring it back forward like this. And then you have like this white tab that you need to flip and bring over like this. Next up, you can take the front wheel and push them in like this. And they need to be uh, like this. And then you need to bring this all the thing on the other side like this and then push it in and then tab on the side here. So let's do the same thing on the other side. So push this in and you can see it's sort of like on a double tab. So you can move it up, move it down, like this, and you need to me to put to, to, to move it as further that way possible. Next up, you want to bring this all the way around like this, flip it up like this, and then you have a tab on top here that you can peg like this. So you have this formation now. Next up, you bring this down. You need to uh, the spoiler needs to be flatten and then you bring this all the way over like this and this will come down and we'll tab onto these two pegs here and there you go we have RC all done so just pose her and yeah voila she can yeah. <laughs> she has such tiny feet there you go <laughs> so yeah she is pretty cool I love her, the, the, the style of it, the backpack cleans up very nicely. Uh, my only problem is maybe like the legs are sort of like uh, a little bit too wide here. I wish we could just squeeze them more, but you can't really because of the joint. So we can, yeah, there's no real, uh, maybe, oh, we can tab it in a little bit further. You need to push, ah, there you go. Okay, you need to push the uh, legs further, and now it's much better, yeah. So yeah, there you go, we have RC. We can give, him, uh, give her her weapon. <laughs> so, got the rifle right here. And where did I put the pistol? It's on the camera. Uh, there you go. So, pew pew, bang bang. There you go. And yeah, now it's just a matter of making her whole because she has really tiny feet. <laughs> but yeah, I really dig the look. Love the head. Nice looking head. The head is on a ball joint so she can tilt side to side, up and down, and rotate. She can also move like... <laughs> arms, uh, shoulder, ball joint, rotation of the uh, bicep, uh, double jointed elbow. Uh, she also has a uh, swivel of the wrists. No rotation. No, no rotation of the wrist. To have waist rotation, the legs can do a split. She can move the leg forward like this, backward like this. She does have a swivel at the uh, just above the knee. She does have ab crunch also. Forgot to mention. 
and knee is on a double joint and the ankle can move and the toe can tilt so yeah it's pretty decent pretty nice so that's uh that, that's pretty much it for the figure <laughs> uh, yeah she is very nice like the plastic quality is amazing uh, it feels really high grade but yeah my main problem is just making her stand she has so tiny feet <laughs> so we can do maybe a quick comparison with the other uh, figures uh, other RC's collection so here we have the <laughs> my little RC collection <laughs> It doesn't even fit on camera. So yeah, we have the mechanic toys uh, with Dr. Wu crossover here. And uh, all the rest. <laughs> We've got the Shoto Q uh, Trumpeteer. Uh, this is Toy World, I think. Uh, the uh, chibi looking one. Uh, this is uh, Unique Toys. Uh, Cybertronian. Uh, iGear. Uh, we have the RC Prime. We have the iGear. Uh, fan Toys, Ocular Max, Masterpiece, Nicey, Toy World. Uh, we have the Legacy, Animated, uh, SDs to our Iron Factory, uh, Beast Hunter, uh, our Valkyrie, uh, Generation, Titans Return, and I think this is animated. Uh, not animated, but the. Uh, oh, is it Bumblebee animated? The. Uh, I don't remember. There's just so many. And, oh, and the previous. Uh, Earthrise also, so yeah, a little bit the nice family, you know. Let's go uh, like this. Help. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I'm just gonna get this cleaned up a little bit, and uh, we're gonna check the faceplate we change on masterpiece one. So we have the masterpiece here, and may have been like mistransformed the backpack. I, I I don't mind. It's not that that is important. We just want to check out the new faceplate. So this is the faceplate that comes with uh, the uh, Mac the uh, the Mac Studios Mechanic Studios, and I, I'm very curious why it does <laughs> come with a faceplate for the masterpiece. But uh, yeah, I don't mind. So uh, we just have to open this up and close this and you remove by sliding the face up like this. Interesting comparison. So this left is on a masterpiece and right is the new face. And you can see a uh, tiny difference. Only the eyes mostly and the lips maybe. Bigger lips, smaller eyes. Yeah, kind of cool. Let's see how well it fits in the helmet. So you just slide it back in, close it, there you go, close it, so there you go, new face, and uh, pretty decent. Uh, if we put it in the back track, uh, we can use the glasses on, can we? I'm having difficulty. <laughs> Alright, like this, might be. There you go, slide it in, backtrack. There you go, pull out the visor, and yeah, there you go, it fits, and it's pretty damn cool. So, I'm not too sure which one I prefer though, the smaller eyes? Yeah, maybe. Or the bigger one. Oops. <laughs> Well, I think I'm gonna stick with the smaller eyes, so yeah. Well, now I just busted all the uh, backpack, but yeah, it's okay. <laughs> so there we go, uh, the masterpiece with the new face and the backpack all mistransformed, but don't care. That wasn't what I was trying to show. So yeah, a Mechanic Studios partnership with Dr. Wu for the RC. This is a high recommend. One of the great RC figures, especially for its size. It's one of the better ones. Even rival some of the bigger ones, I guess. But yeah, really cool figure. Comes with a face, two guns. Really high recommend. So, yeah, that's uh, pretty much it for me. Uh, you know the song, like, subscribe, leave a comment, blah, blah, blah. I right, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.